Tiffany Ellis and here now are the stories making our e-news and reviews for this week. Now Dexter Dapps and Aishana are easily two of the hottest artists in Jamaica right now. But as Jamaicans say, Hata Yard and Hata Farin, two different type of hat. So we're in Florida right now for a show called Blitz and that's what we're trying to find out. Are Dexter Dapps and Aishana pulling their weight in the United States? We're going to find out first and right now. The luxurious banquet hall in South Florida on Saturday night. Blitz, a brainchild of Joe Bogdanovich and the Downtown team, saw the two stars performing in Florida for the first time. Blitz is all about good times, you know, just great party vibes and great entertainment. You know, exceptional great entertainment that's it's infectious, and that's and we get creative in how we do that. We talk to everybody. It's not just our artists; we have other artists. Before Aishana and Dexter Daps juggling from Cold Red's Chris Diamond and a host of other DJs. Artists like Dexter Daps with the controversy with Aishana, you know, and most of the females are come for the show. So them the officer for Chris Diamond, you know, me the ladies' favorite DJ. Then hosting duties from internet superstar Travis signaled the start of the live element of the night. Just make everybody enjoy themselves. We know that we, like, back then everybody had danced together and all of that. Introduce a couple of the upcoming artists and top artists in the business right now. We just have fun tonight. Newly signed down sound artist Cuban warmed up the audience. Then another internet star, Lincoln 3 Dot, doing well with the ladies. Every girl, man, welcome to Answer, sir. Talk to us about being here in Florida at Blitz. Well, it's a good feeling. I don't know Florida, my place, my all is there. I do a whole heap of bookings here. So my style is just different. It's kind of like rap mixed with dancehall with madness, you know? Yeah, so I'm going to say a dancehall artist. I'm going to say I'm a rapper either because I flow like a rapper, but I talk patois. You see what I'm saying? All that was left to see then was the impact of Aishana and Dexter Daps in this foreign space. First, Aishana with screams and cheers from her mostly female fan base. And by the footage we see here, her presence was felt. performing in Fort Lauderdale and trust me the vibe was amazing the woman them come out please yeah them come out to talk to them you know me just represent for the woman them I represent for the art girl them that's what it was all about and I love the feedback I love the energy everybody was very just in tune to everything that was going on it was just great chemistry with me and my family and then his trouble with police in Jamaica notwithstanding the man of the moment in no uncertain terms Dexter Daps. The 7 Eleven star had the high volume of females eating out of the palm of his hands. You see it, man? All of Florida said Dexter Daps. All of Florida come out and come give you a big strength on me. I appreciate that. You see me? Uh, the girls them come out for see we are with there. Like a, like a incident, you know, everybody I wonder. Would they we show up and we do a thing and the girls them look like them like it. Would they go and we'll have vibes with them and take two pictures. Don't know them Instagram of it. Turn up. I think that uh, I think that South Florida had we had a very good turnout here tonight. And uh, I think that you know this is what we do. The vibes are happy, you know, there's no problems, there's great entertainment. All the all the entertainers are fabulous. <laughs> Acoustica Levy is the name of Barrington Levy's brand new album, a 15 track compilation with a vibe and a feel in keeping with the album's title. This album means a lot to me because this is the next stage of my life, and um, I definitely put a lot into this album. You listen to this album, you can see that this album was well put together, you know what I mean? We spent time on it, not no hurry come up thing, you know what I mean? 
we mix, we mix, we mix here in Jamaica, we mix in New York, we mix in California. A listening session and a launch for select patrons and media was held at CNC's South Beach in New Kingston on Monday night. It cost a lot of money to put this album together, you know what I mean? And I, I did this on my own. You understand? It was no record company. All this was funded by Black Roses Enterprises Limited, so... You know what I mean? I, I need the support. The album, which is now available on iTunes, is already garnering great reviews. Michelle on iTunes said, What an amazing album. I've been a fan since I was a kid, and this album sends chills up my spine. Makes me love Barrington Levy even more. My fans, I'm here, still, still kicking in full stereo sound. <laughs> It was an opportunity for consumers to live the life that the high-end brand represents. Hennessy V, the black tie edition on Saturday night on the waterfront, downtown Kingston. The event is a good event. It's a well-packaged event and it stands for what Hennessy stands for. It's all about fashion, all about mixing up the right people. It's a great event and we have to be a part of it. The event attracted hundreds of patrons who were all dressed to impress, but who didn't miss the opportunity to really enjoy the music and vibes that the four-year-old concept afforded them. Okay, within the Jamaica landscape, you don't really have many events or maybe not even another event which asks patrons to dress up like this. You know, and people like that kind of thing. Um, I mean, they get to just showcase their style. Um, they get to showcase who they are through their fashion. And speaking of fashion, Bellas and Boys, Caribbean Fashion Week 15 is around the corner. This is a very, very special occasion. And that announcement was made by means of a fancy launch at the refuge of Villa Renai on Tuesday night. It's a milestone year for us and because we're celebrating that milestone, we've, we've chosen to do a lot more on Fashion Week. Really put a new spin on Fashion Week again and really expand what Fashion Week is. It's, it's now what a lifestyle product. It's total fashion. Total fashion is the theme of this year's staging, set for June 6 to 15 in Kingston, with the runway shows at its home, the National Indoor Sports Centre. It's not just the clothes on the runway on those on Thursday, Friday, Saturday of the, or Friday, Saturday, Sunday of the final weekend, but it's what do you wear to the show. So you have the boutique shows on the weekend before. It's how do you prepare for the show. So it's about the spas, getting your facials, your nails, your hair. It's about the gym, making sure you can fit the look. It's about um, the car you wear. Among the entertainers set for CFW 2015, crowd pleaser, Billy Ocean. The people, the energy, everything is just perfect. The perfect blend of people and music and fashion. Well, that brings us to the end of E! News and Reviews for this week. Winfrey, what do you have for us? Oh, Tiff, a lot. You know, including Joe Bagdanovich responding to all the rumors and speculations. Yes, what's been going on? Um, that... that Toya's passing has generated mm -hmm. that we'll be taking on. Plus, the peculiar Jamaican success story that is Jay Capri. Massacre, the new object of Aishana's affection. All coming up right here on stage. But first, videos making our video stage after the break. My body, yeah. my body, yeah. my body. Yeah. Make your donkey, wait. Wind up your body, feel me, your body.